a larger battle ahead. So with this Four of Pentacles, Leo, I feel like you are storing up energy. I really feel like you're storing up your energy. You're deciding, you are being discerning, shrewd discer discernment of what, again, with this Eye of the Needle, you have shrewd discernment of what deserves your time, attention, and energy. Welcome, Leo, to your reading. Come on in here, Leo. Sun, moon, rising, Venus. Cross watchers are welcome. Welcome to a realm where the whispers of the cards illuminate the path ahead. I'm Tiffany, your friendly, intuitive, intuitive empathic tarot reader. This is Wasted Traditions Tarot. Welcome back to all of my supporters. And if you're new here, welcome. Consider subscribing, clicking the notification so you don't miss any upcoming videos. Liking this video, share it. Comment below what resonates with you. All right, in meditation, I sat and I pulled a single oracle from the Shaman's Dream Oracle. And for you, Leo, <clears throat> we have Eye of the Needle. Eye of the Needle for you, Leo. So this is intentionality. This is clarity. This is positive outcomes. This is shrewd discernment, Leo. Okay? This is from the Shaman's Dream Oracle. So this is where we are starting off. This is what... Spirit has given as the starting point for you, Leo. This is timeless. So when you receive this message, it is meant for you in this appointed time. Thank you so much for joining. So I am the needle for our Leo friends, right? This is mastery, okay? Again, to intentionality, clarity, being focused, laser focused, shrewd discernment, okay? This is success. Spirit is telling you. Your path ahead, this overarching theme, success, abundance, power, material wealth, mastering what you set out to accomplish, taking action to complete what's in front of you, um, moving, setting aside or dismissing anything that is a distraction, that is non-essential, so that you can succeed, Leo, okay? Let's get some main themes here with the tarot your current energy leo what could be restricting you or conflicting for you and then a possible final outcome we'll have some clarification and understanding with another tarot deck okay leo divine spirit what does leo need to know right now do tell current energy for leo okay Current energies for you, Leo. All right. We have the devil. You have Capricorn showing up in your reading, Leo. So that could be somewhere in your birth chart. Again, this reading is for Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, or a cross watcher. Thank you for joining. Could be a Capricorn. But your current energy with the devil card showing up, Leo, what I'm feeling uh, with this, there is something, the intentionality Okay, here we go. Thank you, Spirit. Your intentionality, your focus, you're out of focus right now. You're out of focus. You're letting people, places, or things distract you. That's what I'm feeling with this devil card. Okay. It feels like for someone, Leo, um, you're allowing particular person or people to hold you hostage it feels like holding you hostage to something from your past leo we're going to get clarification and more guidance from divine spirit with tarot let's get the rest of this out what could be um restricting conflicting uh leo right now divine spirit do tell okay the wheel wow okay so crossing you, the wheel comes up as cross, crossing. Um, I feel like for someone resisting change because you don't want people to see the real you, Leo. 
you you don't want them to not like you anymore or something like that is what I'm getting with cross the uh, the wheel at your place of conflict right and then we have the chariot as a final outcome that is some um, cancer energy coming up in the reading Leo let's pull out more of the tarot we're gonna dive deep so before I go any further let's get some more tarot divine spirit we need more for our loyal Leos for our uh, King and, and Queen Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Divine Spirit, do tell, give us more. All right, let's see what what we get from Spirit. Oh, this wants to stay on the table. We're gonna take it. The Hanged Man. All right. <clears throat> Four of Pentacles. Strength, Leo, you're showing up in your own reading. I'll pull the rest of these. I'm not going to turn them just yet so that I don't squirrel on you. Get distracted. <laughs> All right. So let's start with your current energy, Leo. Current energy, again, is the Devil card. So with this Devil card, Oh, wow. Okay. So the devil card comes up in your current energy, Leo. Okay. What I'm feeling with this. There is some deep healing you've been you've been doing. Some introspection is what I'm getting. I'm actually feeling hermit energy for you, Leo. With this devil card, you've been going within. You've been trying to deal and work with your shadow self to understand yourself better in order for you to understand others, right? That's what I'm feeling. Your current energy, you've been doing a lot of work, Leo. Um, a lot of introspection, self-reflection, doing some, some serious deep dives, some healing work, bringing yourself into harmony with the universe is what I'm feeling. For you, Leo. Okay. And with this current energy, we have the hangman, four of pentacles and strength again, showing up as yourself. So uh, with that feeling of you doing some introspection, we have the hanged man here. And what I'm feeling with this hangman, you've been patient with the process and the journey that you're on. Leo is what I'm feeling with this hanged man energy. Um, Really trying to enlighten yourself to to level up your life you are using the meditation and the deep dives to level up your life Leo is what I'm feeling with this hanged man card you are looking to have new perspectives and a better understanding of who you are as an individual Leo that's what I'm feeling here and then with the four of Pentacles showing up for your current energies along with this devil, with this Capricorn energy. So the Four of Pentacles is showing up. And this is what I'm feeling here. There is, you are saving your energy because I feel like you have a feeling of a larger battle ahead. Like this is just the surface for you. You've just started to do the deep dive. For some of you, you've been in self-reflection for a while now but I feel for the majority of Leo you're at the beginning you're at the starting line or just have left the starting line on your journey to self-discovery uh introspection reflection of your life what has happened for you what you have learned from the things what you have learned from your experiences with people and and situations. So with this Four of Pentacles, Leo, I feel like you are storing up energy. I really feel like you're storing up your energy. You're deciding, you are being discerning, shrewd discer discernment of what, again, with this Eye of the Needle, you have shrewd discernment of what deserves your time, attention, and energy is what I'm feeling. And then we have you showing up in your own reading, Leo, strength card is here, right? And it has taken courage 
for you to do this because it's hard to look at the undesirable things about ourselves. It's hard to look at, accept, and work with our flaws and our imperfections. We are perfectly imperfect beings on this planet, right? So you've been using a lot of courage to do this deep dive is what I'm feeling, Leo. And then with the wheel giving you some resistance in your resistance area you have the wheel this is some um this is what's crossing you this is what is conflicting for you leo what i'm feeling with the wheel i feel like you are you want to change leo and yet you don't want into anyone to know you are changing is what i'm feeling you are conflicted about showing your new true colors, your authentic self, who, who you've always were born to be, Leo. So let's turn over and see. Okay. So we have Aquarius showing up in your reading, Leo, with the star card. We have the magician here and we have the knight of cups. If you notice, the magician and the strength card both carry the infinity sign on these on these cards, right? Leo, you are limitless. You are limitless and it is up to you to believe in that about yourself. You are limitless. So so the conflict of change or you you going back and forth with yourself about do I reveal who I am? Do I reveal what I am truly capable of? Can I show my authentic self and be safe? You are limitless. And powerful, Leo. So with this star card coming up in the area of resistance, again, there is Aquarius in this reading. So this Aquarius could be a cross watcher. Aquarius could be somewhere in your birth chart, um, Leo. Okay. So you have the star card showing up. And what I'm feeling with this star card showing up in the area of resistance alongside the wheel uh, kind of fight. I feel like you're, you're struggling. You're fighting with change. You know, change is necessary. And like, you want to hide the new changes of who you are and who you were always meant to be. But with this star card, spirit is letting you know, be peace, be at peace, be at peace with who you are, be at peace with revealing who you are, what your abilities and capabilities are. That's what I'm feeling with the star card. Be at peace. Have serenity in knowing who you are and, and being who you are. And then here with the magician showing up for you in this area of resistance, Leo, this is your power. You, are, you have the power to accept change in your life. You have the power to, to, to um, pull peace and serenity towards you. You have the power to be exactly who you are. All the resources, like with the magician card, the magician card is cups and swords and pentacles and wands, everything, everything, right? So you are everything. Again, with this infinity symbol on both these cards, Leo on the strength card coming into your own reading, you are able to do everything. You are able to, excuse me, traverse all sorts of situations, even with this struggle of being you. And then we have the Knight of Cups. This is spirit reminding you, telling you, do it. Let the struggle go. Like my grandmother used to say, you're twix in between with this change, with the wheel card showing up in your area of resistance. So with this Knight of Cups, go after the desires of your heart. You desire hope. You desire peace, I should say. You, you desire serenity. You desire to live authentically. And this Knight of Cups, here's your sign. Live authentically. Go after the desires of your heart, Leo. All right. And let's move on to the final outcome. You have cancer in your reading with the chariot card, Leo, right? So with this chariot card coming into the final outcome, this is your victory. This is showing how strong your willpower is, how uh, you shrewdly discern what you're going to cut out of your life. What you you are discerning with shrewdness. What cannot fit through the eye of this needle, right? 
The eye of the needle is very specific. It takes intentionality. It takes clarity. It takes positive uh, thinking, right? So with the chariot showing up in the final outcome, you put aside, you drop anything that is standing in your way of success because you have to winnow down all the foolishness to get the connection to the essence of what it is your life means, right? The eye of the needle looks so tiny, but once your intention threads through it, there's a vast uh, new perspective. Here we go. Yes, a new perspective that you're searching for diligently now. Opportunities open up to you. Right with this cherry card. This is reminding you, you are in control, Leo. You are in control. Let's flip the tarot and get some more understanding. You have chariot twice in the final outcome, Leo. You have chariot twice in your final outcome. The universe says, I said what I said. You are determined. You are victorious. Your willpower will carry you through this. You are discerning. You are intentional. Your focus is clear. Things are coming into focus for you for anything that is what is worth your time, energy, and attention, Leo. So the chariot twice in your final outcome with the Knight of Pentacles and the Four of Wands. There's the victory. There is victory. The chariot, victory. Celebration. Four of Wands, victory, and celebration in your final outcome with this Knight of Pentacles. Okay, Leo. So the night, the night of Pentacles is is your uh, reminder that you, you the hard work that you're putting in, the hard work you're doing, brings you to your victory, brings you to your celebration. That victory, that celebration, it's it's within your control. Two chariots in your final outcome. This is within your control. Four of Wands. This is your victory, right? This is, you have been, you have been hard at work. You have been responsible with where you place your time, energy, and attention, Leo. And this pays off for you with the four of wands, right? This is a big payoff. This is, this is your achievement. This is your victory, right? This is beautiful. All right. Let me see. What do I want? I want... I want uh, a few more clarifiers, Divine Spirit. Let's clarify and wrap this up with a beautiful, uh, inspirational bow for our beautiful Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Cross Watchers. Be intentional. Have clarity. Focus. Get into that Queen of Swords energy because the Queen of Swords is clear. She is perceptive. She is focused. She's a great communicator. He or she. Gender does not matter. All right. Justice pops out for you. So with this Justice card, Leo, I feel like there is something... There has been a dispute um, for someone out there, some sort of debate, if you will, a dispute, a disagreement that works out and comes out to be in your favor, Leo, is what I'm feeling with this justice card. What else, Divine Spirit? Mm -hmm. In your favor. This is, this is, it will all, the lies will be illuminated. That's what I'm feeling with this justice card. The lies will be illuminated because lies hide in the shadows. Oh, it's going to come to light. It will come to light. So whatever, for whomever this is out there, those lies will, will come to light. Um, and this will work out in your favor, Leo. This disagreement, this debate, this, this legal case even for someone out there. Who needs to hear that it works out in your favor? What else, Divine Spirit, for Leo? Give me more, please. Okay. That's a lot more. All right. I'm going to take that. All right. So, again, wow. Here is strength showing up again. So, you're in your reading twice, Leo. You are in your reading twice. 
the universe says I said what I said I mean it so with with strength coming up twice in your reading in your own reading you're showing up twice in your own reading Leo you are courageous you are courageous continue to have compassion for yourself as you traverse this journey to be enlightened with this hanged man as you be patient with yourself have grace for yourself right the courage and compassion it takes to walk this journey to take a close look at your perfect imperfections leo you have what it takes to do so and this is spirit reminding you and here we also have the two of coins and the page of wands two of coins in this deck is the two of pentacles so with the two of coins uh showing up for you this is time to remain balanced remain even keel because even though you are conflicted with showing the world who you really are how, what you've uncovered and discovered about your true authentic self be patient again but it's it's time to to walk this thing out with this two of coins to walk it out plan for your next moves right be intentional with your next moves this two of coins is your planning phase and then the page of wands showing up for you leo in your reading right so with the page of wands coming out you it's just reminding me that you are learning who you are who you were always meant to be who you were created to be right not doing to be so with this page of wands showing up for you here's a reminder stay curious about who you were created to be. Uh, continue learning about who you were created to be. Explore those shadows of your life. Explore those things that you call flaws about yourself. Explore those things. Have compassion for it. Because when you learn more about yourself and you stay on the path of self-discovery, it helps you create that plan with this two of coins, with this two of pentacles. It helps you to plan and formulate the next moves because you have a better understanding of who you who you be who you be on this planet right i love this for you i love this for you leo this is amazing all right let's pull an angel number for leo before we close out this reading divine spirit please provide an angel number for leo one angel number for leo thank you spirit Leo, sun, moon, rising, Venus. Your angel number is 1919. Cycles. 1919. Cycles. All right, it reads karma, warning, judgment, influence, power, cycles, changes, rebirth. I love that. Changes and rebirth. Changes and rebirth. You're struggling with the changes that you know you're going through. There's a rebirth happening for you. Do not be afraid of that. Karma will be paying you a visit. Release the need to control because you cannot force things. Learn your lessons so that they don't repeat in the future. Make some space for new experiences. This is what Divine Spirit needs you to know right now. Right? 1919 is your angel number. Karma will be paying you a visit. Release the need to control because you cannot force things. Learn your lessons so that they don't repeat in the future. Make space for some new experiences. So you cannot control everything. You have to have patience. You can't even control the process and journey that you are on currently with this self-reflection, self-discovery. All you can do is go with the flow. All you can do is have patience with, with what is being revealed to you. You can learn your lessons, right? Learn your lessons so you don't have to repeat this. Learn your lessons so you don't repeat in the future, right? Learn what is, who is worth your time, energy, and attention, Leo, okay, so you don't have to repeat those karmic lessons. Things are changing for you. You are changing with the hanged man. You are changing with this star card, right? You are changing with this page of wands, Leo. This is all for your benefit. It is all for your good. It is happening for you and not to you, Leo. I hope that you have found 
information useful and this resonates with you, Leo, uh, please don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, turn on notifications so you don't miss any upcoming videos. Thank you so much for being here. This is timeless. You were meant to hear it at this very moment. I will see you soon. Until then, take care.